Can't let Rhino get away again. Hey, MJ, what's up? You okay? I'm fine. Coming through Oscorp records. Hey, this is random, but you remember that trip we took to Staten Island with Harry? To find the best pizza in the city? Yeah. Ten-hour odyssey for burnt toast with cold American cheese. How could I forget? Something about all these old Oscorp files made that day pop into my head. Harry was so excited about riding the ferry. Just made me think about how much simpler things were back then. No jobs, no super villains. We could throw away a whole day looking for bad pizza just cuz. Now it feels like if we take a nap, the world will fall apart. Yeah, this adult thing is rough. But I guess the work we do means today's kids can have their own Staten Island adventures. In safety. Kind of a circle of life thing. Circle of bad pizza. <laughs> yeah, you're right. That's a good way to look at it. Thanks, Pete. Prisoners have taken a bus hostage. Report came in from God's Acre. Hostage situation. Always tricky. Gotta make sure no one gets hurt. City's turning into a playground for crazy people. Even more than it usually is, I mean. Someone your own size, Rhino. There is no one my size, Polk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Rhino, let's put the team up. Thought you were a loner. That means an egg, Polk. All of life is means an egg. <laughs> for these particular means. Freedom! True freedom! No more cute! No more Trouble. 
Battleside Chats! You are funny, Malinti. I am almost sorry to destroy your tiny things. Okay, Rhino. Let's wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Oh, Scorps, love you, but you do know it's rude to cut in, right? What were you going to do if I didn't show up? Beg him to give up? Yes, Garkin, that is exactly what I would have done. Ah, like an old married couple, you two. on the ground. Gadgets might help. Get him, you idiot! Get him! Drop down the health rock! Guys, please! There's plenty of me to go around! Getting his suit removed. What did Octavius promise you, Scorpion? Money. Gargan has no principles. He fights for profit. Untrue. I rip Spider Man's face off for free. The money. Get me out of here! Be a man, Gargan! Free yourself! Of you, Gargan. You will not obtain this suit control. Try it, friend. Hell, maybe I'll just pull you out of this suit myself. Peace, my peace. It's starting to feel like I don't even need to be here. You guys want to sort this out yourself? Now, you know, I won't tell anybody. And leave your skull uncrushed. <sighs> there is fun in that. <sighs> do you know what Octavius will do if he finds out you failed? I failed? Yes, you freak show. <sighs> Time might help you boys learn to play nice.
All right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's Breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti -terum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. Pete, hey. I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sable's men. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. Listeners are warning that the mayor's sable agents, ostensibly here to protect us, are behaving more like an occupying army. But let's hear it from the caller. Go ahead. They won't let me in my building. You said it's foreign. I said, fine, let me in and I'll stay there. They pointed their guns at me, ran me off like a criminal. I got no place to go. Caller, this is deeply disturbing to me. I promise you, I'll bring it to the attention of the proper authorities. Emergencies do not permit the suspension of human rights. Your elected officials may not be willing to fight for you, but J. Jonah Jameson is. Okay, MJ, I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Mayor Osborne really lives here? There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Uh, left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on. Let's go talk to security. Hey, let us back upstairs. I've got a medical emergency here. Oh man, I can't breathe. Let me back upstairs. Oh, every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs! Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. That should do it. Crap. Jerry, get out here. We got a situation. Get out here right now! Security room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but please remember, Sable is doing this for your safety. Hello. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. Start your way out of here. We're in charge now. Okay. I like this thing. Control. Gotta turn him around. The hell was that? Good boy. I'm sure Sable off elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson, super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs.
Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire him. Stupid useless button. Hmm. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. Work order for keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. MJ, Sable Presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. If Norman bids his son farewell. Huh. This must be from one secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. Norman could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. Norman locked up Harry's room. Wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. I'd be surprised if Norman- This room smells like... rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. It's the combat prototype from the schematic. Uh. 
schematic for the prototype mask. Norman seems to be pushing Oscorp towards defense work. forgot about this. The Osborns have a coat of arms, and a motto. Pax in Bello, peace in war. <sighs> Gotta remember that if I ever write a book about all of this. Looks like Norman locked up Harry's room. I wonder why. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. Listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad. You know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. God, Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. sent Harry away for treatment? I thought he went to Europe on his own. What were you hiding from us, Harry? Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. This is kind of cute. Norman keeps all the campaign buttons from his races. There's one for school board. And he's left room for more. Setting your sights higher, Norman? Can't be for Harry, can it? Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney. Like his mom. Why didn't you tell us you were sick?
Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here! The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. July 18. Bingo. Super creepy. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Some- Norman Osborne. GR-27 research log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, 
to spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Devil's breath isn't a disease. It's an attempt at a cure? I almost can't believe it. Harry and Emily's medical records. GR-27 was developed to treat them. Devil's Breath is a failed cure for Norman's own family. Spiders. Is Norman trying to reverse engineer Peter's abilities? The labels on these cages. Bioelectrokinesis. Optical camouflage. What the hell is he trying to create? What are these things? Prototype hand grenades? Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Look, looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. Had no idea they owned so much of New York. Sable troop deployments. They're stationed all over the city. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Commercial buildings. Wow. So many records facilities. Oscorp's going all in on defense research. No, Norman's not crazy enough to keep the anti-serum in a shopping center. Dr. Strom, isn't he a robotic- A records facility- Oscorp's going all in on defense research. No movement from Dr. Van Adder. Must be out of the city. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Wherever the anti-serum is, he must have been too. Good old Alpha team. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable present. Should check the patrol routes against Oscorp. No. Dr. Michaels was near a lot of Sable forces, but it's not an Oscorp facility. No. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil- Nice. Got some overlap with Dr. Michaels' path. Oscorp building, but no Michaels or Sable. Nice. Got some overlap. Good old Alpha team. Nope. That's just a Devil's Breath Lab must- GR-27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it! Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR-27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. created Lee. I, I have to get this. No! Who's there? Oh, no. Have a breach. High alert.
Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Clear that balcony.
Coming off Lex now. Are you okay? We'll be in a few seconds. Northwest corner. Hey, you ready? Wait, wait, hold on! It's too late. You're up! You are crazy. You're amazing. <laughs> it's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You... you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks. Partner. to get that anti-serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. Okay, Norman's on his way to get the anti-serum. Better update Yuri. I hope this is good news. It is. Oscorp just created an anti-serum. There's a cure? Oh, thank God. How quickly can we get it to people? I'm on my way to find out. The lab is at 10th and Cathedral. Wait. I just got a report of a helicopter going down in that area. Oh, no. That could be Norman's helicopter. I'd send officers your way, but I don't have any. Don't worry. I'm on it. This'll all be over soon. I promise. Prisoners are rioting in the streets. Available officers, please proceed to Koreatown. Electro trying to destroy. <laughs> Some, this is not how you exchange insurance information. Hit! <laughs> 
a bigger transport van. Demons before I can follow Lee into the lab. Time to KO those snipers. gets a hold of the anti -Sira. Easier to take these guys out if they're split up. Might want to pick these guys off stealthily. out the agents stationed here. They're not handling anything. You have been warned, superhero. The demons chewed through Sable. Lee's on the warpath. <laughs> Sable made good on her threat, but these guys aren't looking to team up. Tired of you harassing our agents, Spider-Man. This ends tonight. You guys think I took out your men? You gotta be kidding me! Ugh.
wish Sable would cut me some slack. We should be on the same team. Demons and Sable are down. Time to follow Lee inside. Why are you so heavy? You harass my men, destroy my equipment, and cost my client millions. Give me one good reason I should not kill you right now. Listen, I don't like you, you don't like me. But Lee has your client inside this building right now, and he's gonna kill him if we don't do something. We could fight each other, or we could fight Lee, but not both. Mean we're good? You will help me secure Norman. After that, I make no promises. Works for me. Lee's out of control. You secure Osborne. I will talk to them. Perfect. Okay, Lee. No more running. This ends tonight. This is insanity. I have to find a way to reach the Martin Lee I know. The man who built Feast. to go but down. Lee's pain, his anger, it's fueling his power. I'm sorry. It was an accident. I was trying to help. Yeah. You don't help people. You use them. This won't bring your parents back. Why do you insist? I'm trying to save this piece of scum! I'm trying to save you, Martin! 
Don't let revenge win. Fight it!
this will all be over soon. I sure hope so.
know. But this is the wrong way, Martin. Look on your face. You can't imagine how satisfying it is. Ready for your final act? Not worry about him right now. He needs a hospital. No, no hospital. Feast. I need to speak to your head doctor. There's no doctors here. Well, who's running this place? Me, mostly. Oh, okay. Well, it's been a while, but I'll do my best. I'll need masks, uh, gloves, All whatever right. you have to sterile. Thank you. You can thank me by not dying. Oh my god. They say she could go at any moment. Where are you going? I need to find Otto. He has the anti-serum. <laughs> Maybe you can't. Maybe Spider-Man needs help from his friend Peter. What? Peter helped build those arms, remember? If anyone can find a weakness, it's him.
Go get him, Tiger. That's not it. Maybe it's this one. No. Uh, uh. MJ's right. I built the neural interface. That means I can destroy it. There must be something at the lab I can use. <laughs> 